We are farmers. Bum, ba, dum, bum, 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 bum. Coming to the near side. And the Riverman will work it out now. Puck hopping on Austin Veith. He'll carry it to the red line. And into the zone. Veith will wind up a drive. Rang off the crossbar. No goal waved and score. The linesman was waving the arms. The referee signals goal. The lights gone on. And with 7.14 to go, period number one, we're all tied. Riverman won. Ice Flyers won. We're up to the point. Just held in by Ben Ostroba now. Pass through center is dumped back in toward the net. It'll be picked up by Pensacola now. Back of their own goal as Austin Veith will give chase. Try to work it away from Perigo. As it'll be sent out, front shot, SCORE! Veith and Blasco doing battle in the right wing corner. Worked it out for Veith and ripped it by. Remember, remember the 5th of November. Veith for Vendetta, 18-19 to go, second period. And Austin Veith's got his second of the night. It's now 2-1 Rivermen. And back come the Rivermen the other way as Blasco into the near side on the right wing. We'll turn back at the hash mark, put it down low as Walker will take a nice toe drag shot, SCORE! What a move, Bo Walker to get the puck out front, lost the handle right on top of the crease. Billard followed, Walker not the puck, Kevin Patterson came home and dunked it into the net with 5.39 to go, second period. Peoria's retaking the lead, it's now 3-2 Rivermen. And now someone for Pensacola, looks like Price reached across the red line. As the linesmen are going to try and hold everyone apart. Now Patterson taking some punches there from Pensacola. And everything's going to come together in the neutral zone. As down they go, a mass of humanity. It looks like Patterson being yanked at by Brantley Sherwood. Sherwood now is going to try and steer Patterson to the ice. Ryan Devine is going to be cleared by the linesmen. And aggressively put back toward the penalty box. Now Devine is in a shoving match with the linesmen. As at center ice, the referee is trying to pull Patterson and Sherwood apart. We'll start things back ahead. A minute 52 to go, second period. And Fiore on the power play for virtually the duration of the frame. As Kalis will chip it ahead. Now Greenberg drops it back into the slot. Blasco drives, score! As tic-tac-toe into the slot, Ben Blasco ripped it over the shoulder of Billet. And with a minute 44 to go, second period, Fiore has got a power play goal of their own. And the Rivermen have taken a two-goal lead. It's now 4-2 Peoria. Taken between Robert Lapine and Justin Greenberg here. 10-14 to go third period. As it's tied up through the dot, poked out by Pensacola. To the left wing point, they'll send one toward the low corner as it's knocked away from the slot shot score. As the puck was loose in the left wing circle and crossing the middle, Pensacola ripped it by Stephen Klein through traffic. And don't go anywhere yet. 10-08 to go third period. We've got ourselves a one-goal game. It's 4-3 Rivermen. A 4-3 Riverman lead. And the face-off will go once again to the right-wing circle. As it's drifting toward the net now, back toward the right-wing corner, Marcuz. We tied up, put it out to the point. Kessler, a drive blocked by a sliding rule of issue. Second attempt through traffic, never got through. Out of the left-wing point, held in by Price as time expires. And the Peoria Rivermen have picked up a regulation win in Pensacola for the first time in franchise history. As the Rivermen survive the last gasp effort from the Ice Flyers, blocking shots left, right, and center, and hold off the late surge as the final score in regulation, Rivermen 4, Ice Flyers 3. We are farmers. Bum, ba -dum, bum, 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 bum.